morning guys it is now currently anyone know the time because i can't see my watch uh, quarter to five. it's now quarter to five we've been up since half three some of us been up since three yeah oh actually yeah some of us have been up <laughs> since three yeah that's true um and we're going on our holly bobs yes we are we're just waiting for a lift cases are ready and so are we Like the yellow one. He's my fave. You would. I'm gonna sit in the chubby chubs. <laughs> oh wow, look at that Mintos. Mintos. Six ninety nine for those. Big old tub. Mm. <laughs> Dean's happy. Well, Going for the orange. And the no, normal almond. one. No, almond. Oh, almond. almond. Yeah. Yeah, I like that. It's really well done all the way around. That's fun. It's the wrong way. For any of you that want to know why I'm running so smoothly, <laughs> it's because Dean's pushing me. <laughs> we got airport assistance. Best thing you've probably done. To be yeah, it's best it's thing we've done. From start to finish. The minute we got here, it's a minute now, and the staff have been great. I highly recommend. Sorry, it's really hard to judge where you are. I'm around here somewhere. You're around there, there he is. Oh, not a great shot oh, for me. <gasps> we can see two planes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Won't you take me for a ride? I will love the feeling of the wind in my hair while speeding. On the highway down by the sea, we go out. Fantastic lot. We're here in sunny Escala, Spain. Woo -hoo -hoo. And today we're going on a trip around the island, stopping off at many places, and we're going to take you along with us. 
So I hope you enjoy it. These are the salt flats of Las Salinas, a huge patchwork of wetlands. It was the island's chief earner for over 2,000 years. So as you can see, we've arrived in San Antonio. Oh, I'm trying to get it in, and there's the egg. Just gonna go for a bit of an explore now and see what's around. Oh, I'm getting spray off of this fountain and it's amazing. So pretty, this all lights up of an evening as well. I'm currently at the harbour in San Antonio. All oh, those boats, it's a beautiful day. And there's the beach. Uh, this is new since the last time as I was here so these are all around the world now aren't they so it's all the rubbish and everything that gets picked up from the sea and they use it as a sculpture and it looks like it's been emptied out relatively recently because it's not got much in there but it is the start of the season over the other side you can see there that's San Antonio Bay so that's a much quieter part of San Antonio in respect of you're not on top of nightclubs, musics and bars. You've got the odd few, but you can get a boat from over there to this bit, which only takes about 10 minutes tops. And that's lovely. It's just a nice distance away. And then we come over here and we've got all the shops and restaurants. So we're just gonna have, have a quick look. So it's a bit closer look at the bungee ball for you. Yeah, that would not be me. That's something I definitely, you wouldn't see me doing. And a blast from my past, Es Paradis. Used to love that club so much. Fills up with water. I used to love that club so much. It fills up with water. And uh, the only thing is, you come out at four o'clock in the morning or whatever, you can't get a cab because you're soaking wet and they don't want you. So bear that in mind. Hopefully your hotel's in walking distance. We've now stopped off at Playa Serenio Gran. And it's really beautiful. We've just had some lunch. Well, I say lunch. Dean and I had a San Miguel because why not? I'm on Holly Bob's. Uh, Becca and her mum, they had pizzas. It's very nice. But look at this view, guys. Look at that. Isn't it gorgeous? The sea looks beautiful. Oh look, there's a little putty cat. Mm. It's beautiful, isn't it? Our final stop is at the Dinky Port of San Miguel and we visit the caves of Canmarca. Important to know things about the cave are that the caves have over 400 steps so this excursion isn't suitable for the less than mobile. There's a mini light and sound show in the caves which includes flashing strobe lights so this isn't suitable for those that may suffer from light sensitivity or epilepsy and we can't stress enough for you to wear very comfortable shoes for this excursion. They are a must. <laughs> 